Riverside Community Hospital has made the commitment to become Riverside County's first and only level one trauma center. This means that after a rigorous review of the trauma program here at Riverside Community Hospital, it was discovered that we had all the requirements of a level one center to include all of the surgical services required, all of the resources required, as well as all the training, training programs and resource programs required of a level one center. Designation as a level one trauma center represents a commitment by Riverside Community Hospital to take the best care of our community's trauma patients. Uh, Riverside Community Hospital's trauma center is the first and only level one trauma center in Riverside County and only one of two level one trauma centers in the Inland Empire. We treat over 3,000 trauma patients a year in our emergency department and admit over 2,000 of these trauma patients. We have a, a fully uh, functional and immediately available operating room as well as other um, high, high um, intensity uh, intensive care units, um, as well as uh, all of the surgical and medical subspecialties needed and expected at a level one center. Trauma centers are classified based on the level of resources and capabilities that they're able to treat uh, trauma patients with. There are generally four levels, level one through four. Level one being the highest level of capability and resources. Level three and four trauma centers, they can take very good care of trauma patients, but they're simply not required to have the resources that level one or level two trauma centers are required to have. Level one and level two centers are quite similar. They're required to have the full range of surgical and emergency services, and these services need to be available immediately or within minutes of the patient's arrival. This includes emergency physicians, trauma surgeons, neurosurgeons, and trauma orthopedists, all required to be in the emergency department within minutes of a patient arrival. And these capabilities are backed by an operating room that is stocked to take care of the most complex injuries, again, needing to be available within minutes of arrival of a patient. Level one and level two trauma centers differ and that a level one center has a dedication to research and training. At a level one center, you might find residents and medical students learning how to take appropriate care of trauma patients. And in addition, a level one center is committed to a research program. So the functioning of a level one center not only benefits the patients that the trauma center treats, but benefits trauma patients in general. Uh, Riverside Community Hospital's Trauma Center is located um, between uh, many major thoroughfares, so we take care of a lot of uh, motor vehicle accidents. Uh, this area is also a, a large area for uh, recreational uh, vehicle use, so we take care of a lot of the patients that become injured after um, uh, the recreational vehicle uh, accidents. And this is a city, and like any other city, we take care of uh, patients who unfortunately are victims of gunshot wounds, uh, stab wounds and uh, interpersonal violence that you may see in any other, um, any other city in America, unfortunately. Riverside Community Hospital, as a level one trauma center, accepts transfers from across the region, including the desert and mountain areas, because we do have the highest level of trauma resources and capability in the region. And we ensure that the trauma patients are appropriately taken care of by our excellent trauma service here, by our excellent surgeons here, and by our excellent emergency department, and all the rest of the surgical and medical resources that we have available at this level one center.